The auditions, he says, are at the Toronto Reference Library, and then they're in the parquet outside the reference library, and then I'm meeting with his, like, production coordinator instead of the director, and I have to, like, sit there on a bench and chat, sort of like this, with the production coordinator, and I'm like, what is happening? Where is the guy? Like, and... <laughs> Finally, he shows up, and we all, you know, have a really good conversation, like, make, like, old friends. It's feeling very, like, L.A. style. Um, And then, like, I read some lines, and he's saying things to me, like, okay, cool. Can you talk quieter? Can you talk louder? Can you do this at this point? Can you, uh, can you cry? Can you, he's like, Okay, but more natural. He's like, you keep laughing. Why do you keep laughing? More natural. I'm like, I would laugh in this situation. What do you want from me? Like, that's my reaction to this moment. He's like, but that's not natural. I'm like, (laughs) nothing about this is natural. (laughs) This is fucking weird. And then, uh, you know, I get the part. I go to meet him on another park bench in another location in the city, and I uh, am to sign the contract, and it's for like $1,500 or something like that. And then he says to me, he's like, so you're okay with the nudity? And I was like, hmm? He was like, the nudity, the part like has full nudity, it's in the thing. And I'm like, no, no, would have noticed that. That wasn't in the breakdown when I submitted for this and he was like mad at me for the fact that I had gone this far and I wasn't fine with the nudity and it was just like well it was surprise nudity so 